Arthur Newman marries Elsa Raymond. They, Arthur had just started his company, uh, Newman Brothers, in 1912. 1914, he is married. Elsa comes from a family of educated people. The Raymonds, John Raymond, Professor John Raymond, uh, was married. They had five children, three girls and two boys, all of which are buried here in Woodland, Woodland Cemetery. The children were uh, all highly educated. Uncle John uh, was sure of that. Uh, he, being a professor, he demanded that his children uh, speak multiple languages, plus be accomplished in a musical instrument. Some playing horns. My grandmother was instrumental in organ. And he sent her to Essling, Germany to study organ underneath various organ teachers, which she spent uh, a total of about five or six years getting over there to, to study, study the organ. She comes back to Des Moines in, from Germany in, in 1904. At that time, Arthur Newman was working for John Benson, a Benson and Markser construction company. Mrs. Benson uh, was involved in early Des Moines and a, and a music enthusiast where she ran into, I am surmising, ran into Elsa Newman, who at the time had come back to Des Moines and had had several students at Drake University uh, teaching them how to play, play, the, play the organ. As time went on, Elsa became more and more involved in the civic music and in the 20s started the association, the Civic Music uh, Association, Music uh, Association, with a lady by the name of Gertrude Schloss. Uh, and today the, the, the company or the organization still exists, but she was instrumental in bringing uh, nationally known music, Jean Madeira uh, and other noted uh, vocalists and pianists to Des Moines to enrich the musical uh, society of Des Moines.